So, oh, okay. do you have any particular comments on the fact that there's a story where I think it was Thor going through, like, some troll castles and just a segment of the serpent has been disguised as a cat and has it's, to try it's and the it whole up. serpent it's the whole serpent and it's supposed to be impossibly heavy and he picks up the cat because yes it's it's thor of course he's going to pick up the fucking cat i've always um chosen to believe that that snake is just a cat um you can sometimes depict him that way i, I think some people do depict the the snake occasionally as a cat yeah like because it just of likes that, that specific story it just likes to be a cat sometimes well and it's it's not the Jorg, Jorgmangander didn't do that. That wasn't his doing. That was the doing of the uh, the dwarf or whatever the fuck, the giant, I guess, that, that was in possession of him. He, he had control over him for whatever reason, and he told Thor, this is my cat, pick it up. And Thor went, okay, and we then picked it up. We have witch walk in here. I noticed, but I, I tried to jump on that wall and it didn't work. Wondering where the witch walk... Okay, it can activate Okay, here. it's it's basically just got yeah, to... You gotta do it down at the bottom, though. I, I thought I could do it up mm -hmm. here, and it, it just didn't work. So I think we're just going up. Uh, I want to see if I can break the windows. Mm -hmm. I don't gonna be think they're gonna the... make you do okay, that. No, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna need those. Uh, let's see. This is more of the... Oh, okay, that hurts. Right. Huh, okay, angel gotcha. runes? Something like that. I kind of just wanted to check the camera. Yeah, this is right. disoriented. Yeah, so this is... These are like angel runes, yes. Oh. And that was clearly a large snake. Here he comes. Here's our kitty. Here comes the cat. I like to think of it as being like, um... You know how, like, in Asian stuff, sometimes dragons have fur? Like yeah. a luck dragon kind of thing. Like, just, the Midgard Serpent is a luck dragon, but it's a cat face instead of a dog. And yeah. in the uh, never-ending story, The Book, which is a really good book, um, it's a lion, not a dog. Yeah. But either way, I just like to think that, it's, like, it's, it's... easier to do the dog thing. That's that's why Hollywood tends to do the dog thing a lot. Is it uh, actually easier Because it, it Well, it's puppet? easier, and it, it has different connotations. And if you if you do the dog thing, it's it's like oh, it's childhood's best friend. It's like the lion thing has more of a regality to it, and it makes sense under certain forms of mythology. And also, it's just an Asian to use dragon. Lions instead, yeah, well, that's that's another part of it. There, there's a there's a reason that Chewbacca is a dog. That's that's all I'm gonna say. All right, I mean I I as a cat person, I just kind of disagree with the idea that dogs are the only way to yeah. create that symbolism. No, I, I agree entirely. It's like, dogs are great, but they're not the only thing that's great. No, I completely fucking agree, believe me. You could do that kind of symbology with, like, a hamster and I'd buy it. Yeah, honestly, Hamster dragon, actually. Let's do that. that. That could be cool. Like, honestly, that, that could be interesting. I love almost every kind of dragon, and I can't think of one that I don't. I just want to leave my option open to not like a dragon if I see one that I don't like. Yeah. Has not happened yet. The, am I not hitting it? Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh! Yeah, that was weird. <laughs> the witch walk disconnected for a second there. That was very weird. Okay, I'm just supposed to come up here. Yeah, the sun runes are trying to kill you. Or something, yeah. Okay, there we go. Closed up. Okay, Thanks. we gotta do There's one of the dodgeballs. Huh? There's many bats here. Look at that. Are bats also attuned to the hearts of witches? I hope so. Or is this about to be some vampire shit? I don't know. Because I am... If we, are we gonna bring vampires into this now? <laughs> Look, in my heart, I am attuned to the blood tears of the witch moon, but vampires oh. can be good allies, and I welcome these bats. Uh, this is a choice. We can go up, or we can go through this door over here. Um. I. Oh, I accept. Wait a minute. Does this have to be like a witch time? Yeah, thing? I assumed it was going to be. Oh, this is one of the witch time doors. Although it's changed colors. No, I think. Yeah, it's... no, that's a witch time door. Yeah. Okay. And I guess we're going upstairs. Oops. Upsta up, up, upstairs. There we go. 
<laughs> Great. Okay, yeah, there's a there's yeah. a thing up here. Fair enough. We just yeah, take we gotta all get our these items. Pot. Oh, hey. And this bullet. That's important. <laughs> it is. Uh, let's see. So we'll go ahead and fix this. Something is stopping it from reforming. Oh. Oh, it was a Fight. trap. Okay. That's fine, I guess. Oh, you two again? In enclosed spaces? Oh, I, fuck. Oh. Yeah, that, that wasn't a good hit. So these were Glory and Grace? Yeah. Those are girls' names. These are girls. You think so? I, I am choosing to believe those are... are these Female are the, angels. They'd be like the only ones. These are like the sisters. And we just keep running into them because they, they don't want to give up because they have each other. Or something, yeah. Yeah. Oof. Okay. I didn't realize it was so low on health. <laughs> but now that I've decided this about them, I'm kind okay. of sad there's only two. Because you think you it's have, the same two every time? I This is my personal canon. I'm probably wrong. Okay. Um, but now that I know that there's only two sisters, it's like, okay, well, there's a red and a blue. Well, where's the green and the purple? <laughs> Where is, you've got your your Mario and your Luigi. Um, and you're just <laughs> worried about Wario and Luigi, right? Luigi, Not yeah, Waluigi. You know, no, Luigi. That's his name. He'll never be confirmed for Smash. No, Luigi will never be confirmed for Smash. We should be so lucky that he's never confirmed for Smash. <laughs> uh, oh, no. Okay. Um, well, here we go. Actually, I was referring uh, to the Poe sisters from Zelda. Oh, okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah, like we have like Joe and Beth, but where are Amy and Meg? Uh, uh, uh. Uh, so it'd be I kind of like, wanted to do a big finish on that one, but that's fine. It would be um, <laughs> Glory and Grace and Gretel. And... <laughs> oh, that was real demonic for a second. What's another G name? I don't know. Giblets. Ger Gertrude. <laughs> Gertrude is good. <laughs> Giblets is better. All right, let's, the brown let's get sister. this doing. She has gravy elements. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna have to draw this now, and I'm not sure how. Okay. Oh man, it doesn't yeah, like this me. Yeah, this is a door that does not like me. Ah, oh, crap. Okay. Ah, uh, it's, a, it's a double door. It turns red the second time. That's probably yeah. gonna be the, the thing. I think that might be it. Okay, so I gotta lift it and then run down there and activate yeah. it. Yep. And is that it? Yep. There yep. you go. Okay, I'm outside. <laughs> yeah, but it's raining out here, so now I kind of want to go back. Yeah, I mean, honestly. We had a lot of rain recently. Oh, yeah, yesterday was weird. Yeah, it Around, was pretty uh, bad. what, like 3, maybe 2.30 yesterday? I, I don't know, it was sometime. Suddenly started hailing and... There were like two claps of thunder. Yeah, so there, there. No, no, it was way more than. I that. only heard two. Uh, so it, it started like consistently thundering. No, it was like completely clear and sunny, and then it started thundering nonstop with lightning constantly. It was hailing like huge chunks. The rain was coming down in sheets, and it was still sunny. And it did that for hours, and then just went away. Where <laughs> was I was. It. Uh, because we were not together for this. It was like, it rained for a while and then was sunny. Um, and there was like two claps of thunder and then a customer uh, oh, came into Oh, I'm not going to be work. able to do this one. I'm not even going to bother, I don't think. You can shoot as much as you need to, right? Yeah, but that's, I mean, I guess. No, I can't. I can't oh, shoot at all. Fuck. Yeah, oh. there's no shooting at all. Wow. <laughs> yeah, that uh, that one might be because we don't know the combos super well. That that's not a good. Thing all right, for us. fair enough. But yeah, the like... first one was that too. It was just like a different version of that. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, we get pushed off of this thing. Oh shit. Huh. Yeah, it was like where I was. It was like two claps of thunder and some rain, and then customers coming and saying, "I was thirty minutes ago. I was off, you know, down the street, and it was hailing, and I was like weird." 
And I was bad. indoors and safe. Josh was on the road. Yeah, I was driving around. <laughs> yeah, that was probably scary as shit, and I kind of regret uh, not being it was, there. Oh. It was okay. I don't really care enough. There's there's Kitty Mander. There's a Panzer Dragoon. Okay. Let's pick that up. I think this is the last one. Which graves within the city? <clears throat> Vigrid is littered with the legacies of an ancient age. Amongst these are the stone coffins used to bury departed witches. Along with their fellow overseers of history, the Lumen Sages, the Umbra Witches, use their incredible powers to repel any intrusion upon Vigrid. Under these auspices, the witches abode by the terms of their netherworldly contracts, and upon parting with the physical world, the strongest of the witches were defied, deified. Uh, were deified as guardians and buried in stone coffins throughout the town. These stone coffins were sealed tight, and it said that only those with knowledge of a witch's magic could open them. Even during the witch hunts, when the coffins were subjected to attempted dem uh, demolition, not a single soul was able to peer into the contents. Yeah, we've been getting witch hearts. Yeah, out it, of it those. occurs to me that's the chest that we've been mm -hmm. breaking. I mean, there's other stuff in them, but witch hearts are one of them. I think we've gotten a bullet from at least a few of them too. Yeah. According to one theory, the contract with their demon master stipulates that upon leaving this earth, a witch's soul nor body can remain. It is said Umbran burial customs were developed for that very reason. The women would bury their loved ones in treasured stone coffins to lessen the pain of those destined for the inferno, even if the effect was slight. Today, unable to break the magic seal upon the coffins, the Lumen Sage seal of the sun has been placed upon the stone sarcophagi as a counterweight. If by chance the power of witches were to return to this world, they would be prevented from opening their coffins due to the seal. Oh. This is a clear indicator of the sort of persecution these women were subjected to during the witch hunts. While the whereabouts of the witches' tombs is outlined above, the location of the tombs for the Lumen Sages remains unknown. Hmm. According to remaining records, they had taken up their final resting places with the Umbra in the secluded region known as the Crescent and Sunrise Valleys. It said the Lumen Sages, who conducted their duties not in the darkness but in the light, rest peacefully in their valley after departing from this world. Finally, there are rumors that somewhere in Vigrid, research is underway to, exa to extract the spirit energy from the departed witches. It seems that the fate of the Umbra Witch and Lumen Sage has yet to be truly decided. Was it implied oh, at all before a... now that... Oh, there's yeah. a lot of stuff. We're missing we, one. Yeah, we missed one. Yeah. Uh-oh. That's um, a big pain in the butt. Was it implied before now that the Lumen Sages are all dead as well? It was not. Huh. Yeah. So this is actually a witch coffin on the bottom, but then it's the Lumen Sage stuff on top. Okay. And I guess when we fight it, we might be breaking the Lumen Sage thing, not the witch coffin. The but witch then coffin opens magic. for yeah. us. Yeah. Oh. A piece of an angelic hymn, gold LP. It's merely a piece of the whole record. So this 15th That's century witch died I with a bit of a record. Still can't tell what that is. Can you? Is it gun gloves. swords? I think it's gloves. Oh, that could be interesting. Hmm. All the pieces fit together to form an angelic hymn gold LP. Some sort of silhouette is drawn on the surface. Okay. I think it's gloves. It looked like it might have been gloves or something, yeah. That'll be interesting. Uh, if we can find a gate to hell. It's It's been quite a bit since we've found yeah. one. Uh, I don't think we can go back to the last one we found. I don't think so. That's fine, though. Oh, yeah, it would require the moon to get back. Oh, oh, fuck. Okay, well, thanks. What a dick. Better run. I'm running as fast as I can. Yeah, why haven't they given us a dash? <laughs> I don't know. It's weird. Maybe we have one and I've just never done it. Nope. Okay. Yeah, yeah no. We don't have a dash. Whoa. Whoa. Uh. This is still completely at a pace that's safe, but they're really making it... Oh, it's a big it snake. Yeah. <laughs> this entire time I've been trying to figure it out. It's cute. Oh. And that's the real one, I guess. Well, no, that's her butt. Well, no, that's... You know what I mean. It's oh. pretty cool. I like him. Inspired. First sphere. That's a... He's a big boss. He looks like something that I would try and pet in, like, Endless Oceans. Oh, we're in, like, Subnautica. angel time. Look at this. Huh. Can we ride it? Can we, I don't like... think so. <laughs> I'm thinking less, like, oh, can I tame it? And more, like, can you run up its back? I don't think so, no. 
Hmm. Oh, okay, that time he hit me. Okay. But I, I can kind of do like a witch time on him. Okay. Sort of. I don't like the sound he's making. Yeah, it's a little it. bit disgusting. I agree. Yeah, it sounds like he's trying to hork up a dinner. A little bit. For his babies. Okay, he's coming up and around somewhere here. Oh, hey! Ooh. Neat! What? I don't know. We're just gonna Why punch this we... thing! What is this pose for? <laughs> I don't know. He can't even see you lift your leg. Why lift your leg like that? Was that necessary Jesus. for the I, ritual? I don't know. For demon? the snake? Yeah. Oh, uh, shit. It's eye stalks. I feel bad for it, but cool, I guess? Ugh. Oh, there we go. Start mashing. <laughs> yeah, big, big one. So, I, I, yeah, it's the big crow Aww. again. Nice, the crow gets to eat a snake. That's very realistic. Okay, big old gigaton. Oh, You're let's our see if friend. I can get it. We love you. Oh, I didn't make it. I keep getting him right up to the very last one, and then I don't get it. It's better than I can do. <laughs> nice. Oh wow. He ate that thing's head. Oh well, yeah. <laughs> or I guess our hair ate the thing's head or, or, or whatever. Something. Well, our hair is the medium by which the demon comes out, but that is a full demon on its okay. own. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> hey, that's okay. Uh, Gold medal. Bad. Could have been better, but that's not bad. Yeah. I like it. Okie dokie. And I'm seeing... Oh, oh, oh damn it. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Let me, let me walk away and then come back and see if he, he returns. Because we got that one to come back, so like... Yeah, but we had... Oh, yeah, there, we there it is. It's it's literally just, if you walk far enough away, you can come back and try again. Yeah. Nice. Alright, Umbered Tears of Blood. If they're supposed to be doing this for us, why do they run away? Maybe only a witch could catch a crow. That's how you prove you're a witch? <laughs> I don't know, maybe. By catching a crow? Yeah, I mean, that's, it's a good... A, means of determining a witch the, as, as any, I suppose. I'm gonna catch a crow in real life. <laughs> Good luck. They don't like being caught. Well, if I bribe one and befriend it, it might work. Yeah, it nice. looked like it was... Go, um, go get us this thing. He's got one of the um, the gargoyles in here with him. Huh. Cool. We I hadn't noticed. We should beat it up for Mandragoras. Uh, I, I think that the silhouette was supposed to be one red glove and one blue glove, and it's going to kind of look like those, those the sisters. Grace and Glory. Could be. Yeah. It's taking him a bit. I, I want to see if there's like a chance, like, like just he goes off and then he doesn't come back and it's like, oh, okay. <laughs> I want the one where he comes back and he's like dressed like he's been on vacation. Okay, yeah, yeah it is. Good, good point. Durga. Like we get one and he comes back and he's wearing like a hat. Ooh, there's an alt for Durga. It's extremely expensive. Oh man, can we put that on our feet? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, a product, a production version of the original. Okay, so that it's just, do you want a second set? Because maybe we can put them on our feet. That I, would I be neat.